Hi, good morning. I'm Leon Westhuizen with Orms and Fujifilm here in the Burkhardt in Cape Town. And it's a really colourful space and hopefully we'll find some colourful people to sit in our colourful chairs. What we aim to do is shoot portraits of passers-by, whether they're locals or tourists, any which way. Uh, the beauty of everyday people is something I'd like to capture using the Fujifilm X-Pro2, which is much anticipated. What we're doing as well is we're shooting with off-camera flash, which I'll be triggering with a wireless trigger. The idea is then to give them some of the photographs for free, because there's Wi-Fi and it's immediate. I'll be putting the, uh, the chair right here in the, in the shadow, so that whoever will sit in it will not have direct light on them. I want to make light only by using a flash, and the Fuji does really well with capturing that kind of detail. What I anticipate is 250th of a second, we'll see how that exposure is. At f8, I said 200. I'll be shooting with a wide angle lens. I'll put a, a polarizing filter on here as well to take a little bit more of the light away. Something that I found with the Fuji lenses as well is that they really do respond very well even in direct light. There's not a lot of glare, flare, ghosting, difficulty with focusing, none of that. One of, one of the many features why the Fuji lenses are really well designed. Without further ado, I'm just going to quickly run over, shoot from that side to kind of see what our framing looks like. Hopefully we'll be able to invite one of those guys over to come and sit in our chair. Hi, good morning. Sorry, it looks like uh, you are a tour guide of some sort. I want to do a photograph of locals and of tourists in, in my chair as a, as a demo for the new camera. Okay, yeah. I'm good here. Yeah. Here we go. Can I maybe ask you to turn your chair just a little bit? That's it. Do you like the chair? <laughs> That's it. Okay, three, two. One of the great features is being able to pull the images off uh, the camera onto, onto your iDevice or a, a tablet, smartphone, those kind of things. Uh, one of the function buttons is a shortcut key to the Wi-Fi. The, the moment I press it, it activates its own Wi-Fi hotspot and all I need to do is connect to that hotspot with my phone, open the Cam Remote Fuji app, hit the remote control and now they're paired. I can now shoot with a phone, change, change the settings via the phone, all of those features are available, but the one that I'm most interested in right now is getting that shot of Monica. So I'm going to hit the playback button. Now I'm browsing the camera via my phone. All I need to do now is select the photograph that I want to download and just hit import. And then they sit in my, my phone's camera roll. That's as simple as that. Yeah. And uh, enjoy your picture. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Because we're using a small flash here, I'm, I'm not diffusing it at all. I'm going to just see what the hard light uh, does. I'll expose accordingly. This is the problem of working in the street. For the next shot, uh, I'm going to see what the 35mm does, the new 35mm f2. It's a really small, really stealthy, uh, but also it's super sharp and focuses very fast. So let's see. Another thing about the electronic viewfinder that I really enjoy is in bright conditions like this, it's almost impossible to see uh, what's, what's going on in the screen. With the electronic viewfinder, all you do is you bring your eye closer and the camera switches over into electronic viewfinder. And now you see exactly what your exposure is like. Um, what, I, what I'm doing is I'm testing this camera to kind of see how it works um, with, with wireless control of, of flash in broad daylight. Would you mind having a portrait done? Yeah, sit here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. This is need to get the cars passed. We, we're going to be quick. That's brilliant, brilliant. Here we go, three, two. Just aim the flash right at him. There we go, perfect. That is super cool. Yeah, if you can stand on that manhole, that's, that's perfect. Fantastic. That's really cool. Oh, very nice. Huh? How sweet is that? <laughs> really cool. I'm taking these chairs back to the car and then I'll bring the, um, the more square deco looking one and I'll find you at the Vespa store. Would you be cool with that? <laughs> uh, I've been recruited. 
Okay, Fabio, I'll be shooting from the street. Okay. And I'm gonna see if I can actually get a wide shot of all these Vespas in here. I'm gonna go for the 16 millimeter 1.4 in this case. Shooting at F4 and a shutter speed of 170th. Here we go. So I've changed my exposure now to F5.6. All right, so 275th of a second. And everybody is in it. It's really cool. So I'm swapping out the 16 millimeter for a 56. In this case, what I would like to do is I'd like to get the background more out of focus, which is far easier to achieve with a 56 millimeter uh, because it's a, a aperture of 1.2 maximum. Uh, so it's nice and wide open. And that looks just dandy. That's perfect. No, no, no. <laughs> That's cool. That's really great. Thank you. Thank you so much, Fabio. And um, what I can do is I can take your number and send you the shot if you like. Yeah, that'll be cool. Thanks okay, great. Again, that's just the Wi-Fi feature. Switch on, download, pull it over, SMS or email straight in. This is our last spot. For this shot, I think what I'll do is I'll do two exposures. Uh, one with a slightly wider lens so that we get uh, more of the wall at the top. The second one will be a nice tight crop. We're testing, testing this camera with uh, off-camera flash light. All right. It's just around the corner over here. That's super cool. I open it up just a little bit. My shutter speed is now 125. Just like that, here we go. One, two. And that looks really, really great. That's the perfect smile. Yeah. There you go. Yeah, great. How cool is that? Yeah. So after reviewing all the shots on the back of the camera, after just a quick walk around, uh, I saw that we got four amazing shots in a really short amount of time and uh, the people have already received their photographs and I think that my experience with the X-Pro2 is really that it's taken uh, the user experience and, and making images to a whole new level. Uh, everything is just so easy and convenient. The word game changer is used often but I really do think there's a couple of features in this camera that, that makes the experience with Fuji just so much better. So if you like what you saw and you want to see some more and come and try the camera out and hope to see you soon. Cheers.